Hey everybody, Ormac here. It's been a little while since I had a uh, power session of Adam and King's Bounty. I've kind of chilled out over the holiday, but I suppose I should uh, get something recorded. What is this? Is this turning into music, or is it just someone going psycho on bubble wrap? There we go. All right, acceptable. All right, let's uh, play some caves of quad. Why not? Quid quad cord coordinates. Caves of coordinates. Last time we were a true person, and we got pretty far, further than I have gotten in a while. This time we'll try to be a mutant and see how that treats me. We get less stat points to distribute because mutations. Skill points are important. Don't really need these because I'm going with physical mutations. I guess that'll work. Let's select some mutations. I would like to be a Chimera because physical mutations. Alright, now let's see. I have 11 points remaining. I can get some more by selecting defects. Physical defects because I'm a Chimera. I can't manifest mental defects. So let's see here. What would be handy? Wings would be pretty sweet. Of course, uh, there's a chance you can crash land. Which is unfortunate. But traveling over land at twice speed means you save a lot of food. But you can't wear anything on your back. Which is a theme with uh, physical mutations. Can't wear anything where they are. Generally, uh, freezing and flaming hands could be neat. Heightened hearing, heightened speed, horns, mm, multiple arms, multiple legs. Uh. Four hit points every 100 turns. That's pretty fast for this. I think I want uh, regeneration. Since I'm probably going to uh, just get into lots of fights. Stinger could be cool. Paralyzing... Paralyzing Venom sounds useful. Hmm, Burrowing Claws? They could be neat. Let's go with a uh, paralyzing stinger. And then let's get a defect. Ooh, 67% more water than usual. That's harsh. 
a beak. It gives you another attack, but you can't wear hats. Cold-blooded. You can only determine your general state of health and not your number of hit points. <laughs> that's, uh, that's pretty uh, unfortunate. Spontaneous combustion. That sounds, uh, mildly fatal. Hooks for feet? Ugh. Brittle bones. Ugh. Concussive damage. Ugh. I think a beak. Hopefully we get a floating light source. What about this? I can only select one defect. Alright, so I have five mutation points remaining then. I could get flaming or freezing hands, or burrowing claws, and something that's worth two or one. This doesn't look like anything's worth two. I can't get wings? I have a beak, though. I should be able to get wings. It would only make sense. What blocks me off from get? A stinger blocks me off. A tail. Okay, a tail blocks me off from having wings. 5% chance of falling clumsily to the ground. You tell him, dog. Well, how about I get rid of the stinger, I pick wings, and then I have six points to pick something else. Like burrowing claws and night vision, so I don't need. I see it in the dark, so I don't need to worry about a light source. And. Thick fur? Uh, a little extra resistance. Or slime glands? I think that makes the floor slippery. Regeneration, wings, night vision, burrowing claws. Uh, let's go with fur. I still have a point, though. Fine, I'll get slime glands as well. All right. Now what am I? Did someone start with butchery? Cause that was pretty useful. Access to farmers markets. Hmm. Two random wilderness lures, harvestry, hurdle. Pilgrim seems useful. Marauder gets uh, butchery. Since I have wings, I don't really need to worry about getting lost, sort of. This would help me uh, with my food supplies. I think we'll go with Marauder. And I have a Rostrum. Ah, <sighs> beak face. It's only proper.
Alright, and we start once again in Joppa. What do we have? We have bear meat, torches, three water skins, and only one of which is fused. First, there's my rostrum. It's on my head. I can't remove it. There's my wings. Also cannot remove. Massive feathered wings. The rostrum description is horns, but it is a beak. Don't worry about it. Shh, don't worry. Hard as any natural substance and many unnatural. Spade-like claws. And I start with a torch. I don't need it. I'll take it off. Hey, what can you tell me about Joppa? Speak with that guy to learn about Joppa. I'm looking for work. Go to Red Rock. Okie dokie. Pretty much the same every time. Always go to Red Rock. Also, bonk. Bonk. And I'm through. Not very hard to tunnel through stuff with uh, burrowing claws, as you can see. And nobody cares. Hey, cave. I do not have a knickknack for him this time because I do not start with any trinkets, gadgets, technological items. Whoosh. Hmm, how do I, uh, I need to be able to fly. Let's see, shift Z, spit slime. Z, land, shift X, shift Z, woo, flight, it's amazing, shift X, yay, I traveled to Red Rock without any problems whatsoever, let's see, we have, uh, goats, don't mess with the goats. So there's some going in here completely unexperienced. Which could prove to be a problem. We'll just see what I run into. Kill those things. And this is how far night vision illuminates. It's not bad. Kill the jilted lover. Kill it. Kill it. Whew. Let's go back up and rest. <laughs> A bat. Did not butcher the bat corpse. Also, die bloody young ivory. Stabbing me was very rude. Die prickler. Only I had Yoshi. Make that a lot easier. I don't know what triggers butchery. Ow. Jilted lovers are mean. A spider? dead spider. I killed it with my beak, as is proper for an insect. Beak has a pretty good uh, hit rate. Uh oh. I see you speed seed spitter seeds. Okay, jilted lover. 
I don't like you, and you don't like me. Ow. Crap. There we go. Hang on it. Yay! I gained a mutation point, but I think I need three, uh, two to three, to uh, select a new mutation. Might depend on how many mutations I got. Z is spitting slime. Let's try to spit slime. <laughs> two! Yeah, it's slime. Wee! Slippery! Good to help get away from things that are chasing me. As long as they can't of, you know, move in slime. Alright, let's look at stuff. Four for a new mutation. Okay. Harsh. At 82, I need 150 for skillful butchery. No. Go away. Not complaining about not seeing any, uh, mobile guys here. I'm going to grab this bad corpse and eat it. Now I'm bloated. Please don't scare me, dread roots. Not talk on it. It is totally possible to get completely lost in these caves with burrowing claws because let me show you. This tunnel... There's a wall. See? Completely new area. A random cave. There's more random caves just like it all over the place under here. You could get lost forever. Because I do believe the random caves span the entire map. Yeah, I just spurted blood everywhere. Hey, spider. Level up on plants. you kill you it's a lot of dread roots wish they would drop more tubers I need stuff to sell since I'm not getting any equipment for some reason there's no snap jaws here I'm sure they'll show up. 